Okay, it's about 10.15 a.m. We're taking off from Ljubljana and we're going to do some touch and goes. Not 70 rotating at 120 now, holding five degrees up or 10 actually. Tap the brakes, gear up. Mm -hmm. 270, 300 knots, let's buzz the tower. Bigman 007, continue for west departure. Copy that. Ljubljana Tower, Migman 007, continue for west departure. Migman 007, leaving my airspace frequency change approved. Copy that. Ljubljana Tower, Migman 007, frequency change. All right, let's see if we can make him spill his coffee. I'll drop some smoke as well, as you do uh, at airport towers. Two hundred knots, quite conservative, really. Let's have a look back. Nice. Thoroughly irresponsible that kind of behaviour. And what a lot of fun. Fantastic. Let's get uh, onto downwind and get these touch and goes happening. Right, established on downwind. Let's uh, get the altitude right. That's about there, 1500 feet above the ground. This is the center of my trim. And uh, probably best not to land from this camera angle. There's the motorway. And the runway should be visible. Let's go to the external camera. There's the runway. Right here. Let's do a quick uh, landing. I'll just do a low pass actually because I haven't got permission to land yet. So let's go gear down. Flaps are auto. Run my in sight. Speed brake extended as uh, I started doing recently because I saw it on YouTube. That look cool. Yeah, it's a really awkward angle to try to line up on. Let's try, uh, yeah, a way off center line anyway. Just skirt above the runway there. Looking back, gear up, speed brake in, pop a bit of smoke, and decide which way I want to go actually. Back to downwind will be good. So there we go. Very cool. Fun and games in the flanker. Doesn't get much better than that. <laughs> 